Jordan has this thing where he speaks about not doing fucking um, mid podcast ad reads and shit, but he does do this weird thing sometimes where he clearly does drop, you know, do heavy name drops or, you know, for brands and products he's using that you know he's being fucking paid for, you know? Maybe it's like a direct deal or something. Maybe he doesn't want to do a whole ad read for it, but he definitely does a lot of like, you know, dropping, oh, have you used this? Have you used that type of thing? And this is a good example of it somebody put together because it's very clear he does this all the time. And I'm sure it's not all the way legal, but it's not all the way illegal either. So it's a bit dodgy, but it's just funny how often Rogan does this, this sort of uh, promo in his pod. That is, I think, the hardest for me to... to master and i try to like think about it more is just getting good sleep have you yeah. ever tried one of those like eight sleep mattresses that cool you off <laughs> everyone that uses it says <laughs> game changer <laughs> is what we're supposed to be eating i have a, a device that i use but it's basically like a, a half of a rubber ball that i put in my mouth and i bite down on and i do reps with, with my For face. jaw reps? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where do, do you do this at? Do you do it in the truck? In my like, house. Okay. I mean, like in my office. It sits in my office. I put it in there, and sometimes when I'm scrolling things online, I go like this. So I try to better my face. I try literally, like, my jaw has gotten stronger because of this. I've been doing it for years. Like <laughs> Strong that, jawline. That's, yeah. a, that's a human characteristic that... It's an admirable That's an admirable character. one, yeah. And when somebody has a strong from, jawline, yeah. It comes from eating meat, like tough meat. For the longest time, people thought that it was genetics that shaped and structured a person's face. What can you use that for, you think, as an it's application? It's good to take a punch. Yeah. You need to take a punch. Yeah. Your, your jaw will be stronger. Rock if you it. need to bite things, you have more bite power. Like, I chew sure. right through tough meat. That's like a part of the reason why your jaw is supposed to be strong <laughs> he talks like this and doesn't <laughs> find it funny i would I honestly want nick mullen and those guys to be on the show so badly because some of the stuff this guy says about a blinker of fucking humor is fucking hilarious but then i remember this right so remember this clip then i remembered i saw, i said i remember there was a time when i watched rogan where he randomly just started advertising mcdonald's and no one really recognized when that was. Uh, people didn't realize it. And I think I kind of left some questions on forums and stuff. Cause I was trying to figure out what episode was it. And I finally found the episode where Rogan just randomly ordered fucking McDonald's. And it turned into a McDonald's ad. Let me see, let, let me see if I can show you right now. Honestly, this is fucking wild. I've been looking at this for fucking ages. And I fucking finally found it. It's an episode um, featuring Tim Dillon. And Kyle Kalinske, I think the news guy does a news, you know, reporting thing on YouTube. And he just randomly, in between of the fucking show, he just orders fucking McDonald's. It gets dropped there. Door dashed <laughs> right at the studio. This is fucking brilliant, man. Let's check this out. Swing state. Like, I think the average is Biden's only up like two points there in, uh, for the race. But it is a genuine swing state. But he's winning now with old people, Biden is. He's winning with that demographic. Because of the way Trump handled COVID? Probably because of COVID. That's right. So they're scared. Right. I don't know what their reasoning is, but I just know that that's what the numbers are showing right what now. What could have be, been done differently? Well, we, we've actually COVID. talked about this quite a bit. My, listen, my I'm not a doctor. I'm not an expert. Wait, I'm wait, just wait, an idiot. Wait, you're not? <laughs> I'll go get my medical doctor. degree. You got our food? Uh, do you want me to bring it in here? Yeah, I, motherfucker. Right. One um, I see you over there eating. You're out of your mind. I saw you pull those bags. <laughs> We, we ordered McDonald's uh, in tribute to Donald Trump. If this is his last election. This Honestly, is, this is in tribute well, to me because I eat McDonald's probably more than anybody on the planet. Whether, <laughs> he, whether he wins or loses, he's done a lot of great things to unite the country. <laughs> Whoa. I mean, I think that we all... You've got to love Tim. <laughs> Honestly. We'll have to remember listen. that. This is going to be quoted on someone's <laughs> blog tomorrow. The same people that called you a... Uh, Far right conspiracy theorist. I can't believe who, it. Who called you that? <laughs> I don't know. The text so log. Get people with blue pink watch, hair. Watch, 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 watch. What's the bags? Okay, what's the bags? What's the bags? Yeah. Yeah. Where's the bags? Where's the bags? Come on. Um, where's the bags? Where is it? I think you. He wants. Come on, bring out the bags. There we go. Look at that. It turns yeah. into a fucking McDonald's advert. But the thing is, he this also is the, um, <laughs> gives out a lot of real information. He's, yeah. He's, I, I had three. <laughs> yeah. Is there a third one in there? What'd you get? I didn't get anything. You didn't get anything? I had nachos right before I came in here. What? I thought this was for you. No, it was for you. <laughs> yeah, two filet of oh. fish for me. Thank you. It's the first time in for my Trump. life I've ever passed on, <laughs> on McDonald's, for the record. For the everybody. President. Outrageous. You got a filet of fish? <laughs> Three of them. Yeah, they're great. You're the only person who gets the filet of fish. Dude, they're, <laughs> no, they got, they're, they're, they're massively what? popular. Yeah. I've it's never seen black, anybody eat all, one. Black people love them. They call them the McFish. Mm. Do they? <laughs> it's true. <laughs> 
That's not racist. That's a fact. <laughs> Uh, I'm, I'm black. I've never eaten a fillet of fish in my life, and I never will, to be fair. Maybe American blacks are different than us, but I've never eaten a fillet of fish. I can't imagine anything worse than going to McDonald's eating a fish burger, to be fair. I've heard a lot of black people say, can I have a McFish? Well, I think it's seems, great. It seems racist, but I don't think it is. <laughs> it is. It's right on the edge. There's some things it's right on the edge. That that might- but yeah, anyway, I finally found it. That's the episode. It's here. Um, it's the end of Jerry, end of the world number two, uploaded about two years ago. Sorry, there's a title there, sorry. Um, yeah, they just all they randomly order McDonald's <laughs> midway through and pretend like it's not an ad. <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. You gotta love fucking Rogan, man. When it comes to money, Rogan is about that cash, brother. He does not play with his money. He does not play with the fucking money. When the money's good, he will fucking slip that little fucking thing in there. Have you tried the Jura side? Is a thing? Like, fucking hell, Rogan, like, come on, man. You're out here fucking, you know, biting fucking Rubik's Cubes, thinking you're doing something. Like, come on, bro. Um, We did that. We did that. What else are we going to do? Yeah, because I've got a bounce. What time is it? Oh, shit. Um, okay, cool. What else we got to do here? We did this. We did that. Uh, 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 uh. We did morning combat. We saw the fucking ugly urine covered jackets that they're wearing. Bloody blah blah blah. What else we seen here? Um, oh, actually, favorite favorite burger at McDonald's. My my favorite, the goated, I think so, is double uh, double cheeseburger. Yeah, double cheeseburger. That's my favorite. Hundred percent, my favorite double cheeseburger. Without without a shadow of a doubt, double fucking cheeseburger. Classic double cheeseburger. I don't mess with anything else to be fair. That's definitely my my favorite. My favorite, hands fucking down. Um, I wish because you guys in America have it. We don't have it in the UK. But I wish in the UK uh, McDonald's they could give you Burger King sauce. Sorry, Burger King? No, uh, Big Mac sauce. That's what I mean. Big Mac sauce. Because that Big Mac sauce is brilliant. But I don't like the Big Mac. I feel like it's too heavy. That extra bread in the middle just kills me. But I would love to be able to take that Burger King sauce and put it on a double cheeseburger. You know what I mean? That will be fucking banging. But that Big Mac... um, Sorry, not Burger King. The Big Mac, I like the sauce. But I hate the extra bread in between. But I think if you took the Big Mac sauce and you put it in a fucking double cheeseburger, it would be banging. Absolutely banging. People are saying I'm cliché. Why am I cliche? Is that cliche? Or does everyone like that? Is that like an obvious thing? Sorry, I thought I was special. <laughs> I thought I was unique. <laughs> McChickens are supreme. Fight me. Um, whenever I land in McDonald's deal, got a YMH to it. Fill like fish is superior. You get a quarter pounder with a Big Mac sauce. Ooh, ooh, that sounds good. John Gobbler. That actually sounds even maybe better, actually. A quarter pounder with Big Mac sauce. Yeah, I'd love a bit of that. The only thing that I'm kind of bored now, I don't eat, eat water anymore. It kind of makes me sick. I used to love the Big Tasty. I'm not sure if you have the in, in the US. It's sometimes, it's a seasonal thing here in the UK. But the Big Tasty, that sauce, the Big Tasty sauce is really good. Um, but after a while, it kind of started to make me sick. It's a bit too rich. It's too much sauce in it, too much onion. I don't know, it just made me sick after a while. And I stopped kind of ordering it. So now I just kind of get two double cheeseburgers, fries, and maybe a couple of chicken selects. And that's usually my order. And I kind of run through. Um, I get two cheeseburgers and the meal. Uh, I get bacon, sausage, egg, and cheese, McGriddle. That's a grown-up burger. Food sucks, let's be honest. <laughs> now, McDonald's is good for what it is, isn't it, Jeremy? You know I mean? It's good for what it is. Sometimes the mayonnaise and the McChicken is actually pus. No lie. Ugh. I haven't had fast food in months, but now I want some. Yeah, it's 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 goaded. It's fucking goaded. 